there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in favor of this request? Is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in favor of this request? Is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in opposition to this request? Please approach the podium and give your, state your name, your address. Good evening. My name is Tom Curry. I reside at 2006 North Baptist Street, Valdosta, Georgia. Um, we're here, in, oh, I'm here in opposition to this application. Um, in the 38 years of practicing law and practicing land use, I've never seen where you're going to be considering tonight two applications for the construction of Moody Housing one of which is already committed to another piece of property that's coming up after this one. The applicant for the one that you're under considering now, in its letter, transmittal letter, stated, in quote, quote, the rezoning of the property is wholly conditioned upon the property being used for military housing and only built by the entity that the recipient of the award for the Moody privatization award for contract number ACC, group three, MHPI project, solicitation number AFCEE 11002. After this hearing on this matter, we will also be presenting on behalf of the proposed contract award because this contract has been awarded, and it's been awarded to Valka Bay um, through its affiliate, ACC Group Housing, LLC. And here this evening, AAC Housing is here. We have Mr. Bill Gerlach, who is the project director, who has moved to Valdosta. He is a resident of Grove Point Subdivision. And we also have the attorney for Valcor Bay, Mr. Scott Rapshin, who is here this evening representing this company. Now the point is, is that they have nothing to do with this property that you have under consideration here. They have previously told Allen Engineering or the party who was the applicant that they had no interest whatsoever in constructing this project on their property. However, for whatever reason, okay, they have filed this application. We don't know why because they're not here to present the seat. I also want to introduce to you Mr. Howard Dasher. Mr. Howard Dasher is the president of the Howard Dasher Company, and it is his property under which Valka Beatty has got a contract to purchase in order to provide this housing, which is really the subject of what's taking place here. So what I'm telling you is that under no circumstances will that condition ever be fulfilled based upon the application that you have in front of you. Now, we can only surmise or guess as to what the motivation is associated with why you're having to spend your time, taxpayers' time and money in order to take a look at an application in which the zoning is purely conditioned. We don't know. Um, we do know that the Air Force has selected the site, has approved the site that will be the product which will be discussed in the next application. Uh, they have approved and they have awarded this contract to these gentlemen behind us without the bay. And it will be, this project will also be developed on Mr. Dasher's land should you approve the zoning request that's coming afterwards. Now, I can only tell you this, is that this particular project, and I think the planning staff will also tell you this, has been bounced around for two years. This particular project is part of many projects that Dr. Beatty has been awarded in connection with this. The appropriations for this project, the money's there, the money for the Air Force to do it is there, but it has to close by the end of September. Um, and Otherwise, all those funds that have been appropriated will go away and then the Air Force will have to come back and will also have to reappropriate. Now, we know with sequestration and everything else that's going on, there's a potential loss of a $20 million development project in this county. Now, we 
have two applications for Moody Housing. There's only going to be one property in which it's going to be developed. And it is not the property under which you have consideration here. If you should recommend approval of this, then frankly, it will create you know, a question as to what's taking place here. We therefore recommend that you recommend a denial for this, notwithstanding what the uh, TRC had voted to do. And the other thing to note, the program planner and the zoning administrator both voted to recommend denial of that and the final thing is, is that this is in an MAC zoning. And in the MAC zoning, um, the uh, construction of high density housing is trying to be avoided at all costs by virtue of the fact that we don't want any more encroachments. This county, this is what this county said, do not want any more housing encroachments within the Moody Air Force vicinity. For the specific reason that, as you know, there's going to be another bright condition someday and these are things that they look at. And this county has taken a position to protect that Air Force base for the purposes of our community. So if you have any questions, I'll be glad to answer. Okay, thank you. Are there any questions for the speaker from the commissioners? Thank you. Thank you, Chairman Ball.